welcome back to my channel. Today we are here in La Reforma in Mexico City to celebrate Dia de Muertos. So we are gonna go to put makeup on because I look like this now. So we need to put the proper makeup and yeah, see the parades and everything. So stay tuned. Something that I wanna say, Joanna? Yeah, uh, in progress. <laughs> I'm in progress. Okay, this is this is the before. We will show you the after in a few minutes, guys. So stay tuned. <laughs> maybe what like 50 percent no. less I really like it. You have a lot of style. Mexican style on you. <laughs> <laughs> Now let's talk more about Day of the Dead or Dia de Muertos in Mexico. This is one of Mexico's most important religious holidays and is celebrated on All Saints Day, November 1st, and All Souls Day on November 2nd. Dia de Muertos, sometimes called Dia de los Fields, Disfuntos, traditionally November 1st honors deceased children and November 2nd honors deceased adults. Day of the Dead is celebrated passionately throughout Mexico and especially so in smaller provincial towns and cities. November 2nd is an official public holiday in Mexico. Far from being a morbid event, Day of the Dead empathizes remembrance of past lives and expresses celebrations of the continuity of life. This acknowledge acknowledgement of life continually has roots which go back to some of Mexico's oldest civilization, including the Olmec, Zapotec, Maya and Purpeca. The Aztecs also celebrated Day of the Dead, although earlier in August on the current calendar. Local festivities and traditions vary from place to place, although the ofrendas are the focal point of the celebrations during the festive period. Mexico City hosts a large and elaborate procession downtown and provincial towns and cities hold religious processions to mark the occasion. It is currently fashionable for participants to have their face painted to emulate Katrina's. Although Halloween on October 31st and Dia de Muertos on November 1st and 2nd are strictly speaking two distinct events. In recent times the two festive days have blended into each other, illustrating how Mexico is adept at assimilating foreign things without losing its own identity and often putting a particularly Mexican stamp on them.
Wow, and what a parade! It was amazing, isn't it, Jorge? Yeah, it was beautiful, amazing. It's everything. The first yeah. time ever in my life seeing this, and it's one of my bucket list wishes that finally came true. So I'm really, really excited and happy <laughs> that I've been able to attend this festival and this parade. It's amazing, amazing, amazing. Such a talent in this parade. So what do you guys think of this uh, parade? Uh, honestly, that we are from here, I'm going to rate 7 from 10. <laughs> honestly. 8. Two Manuel? 8. 8. And me 10. <laughs> But you should come here if you have never been. And yeah, I will see you next time. Until then, please stay safe, take care of each other. Goodbye! <laughs> Guys!